Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. For those of you that don't know me, my name is Ashley and in today's video we are going to be doing this dewy, tan, bronze, gold eye look. That's a really long name. But I wanted to film either a bronze eye or like a dewy, luminous skin look um but i kind of put them both together so this is what i came up with so i'm feel super tan because i have some self tanner on and don't mind the lighting right here i literally just filmed finished filming this video and the sun is shining through my window and i don't have blinds all right guys if you'd like to learn how to achieve this bronze eye dewy luminous skin look then let's just go ahead and get on started Okay, so to start off this look, we're using my Smash <laughs> Smashbox Primer Water. And then I'm gonna go in with my Charlotte Tilbury Wonder Glow Primer, so it just looks like this. And I'm gonna throw that all over my face, just because this does leave a nice dewy finish. As you can see, it's just very luminous and dewy on the skin. So I wanted to do this video today because it's like 72 degrees out and it just felt right to do a dewy, bronzy, tan, glowy makeup look today. So I did hang outside for a while today, but now I'm back inside filming. All right, so we're gonna be using my Too Faced Born This Way foundation in warm beige. So I'm going to squirt a few pumps onto here. And then I'm going to do a foundation. <laughs> and then I'm gonna be mixing in my Maestro Glow by Giorgio Armani. Two, three, four, I think it was kind of... And this is also key to having that glowy look is um, mixing in like a liquid illuminator or like glow to your foundation and then also like a luminous primer will also help shine through the foundation. And then I'm just going to take my Real Techniques, this is pointed foundation brush, and just start applying that on my face. I'm going to concentrate it in the center and then obviously blend it out. And then wherever you need more coverage, you can just go back in and apply a little bit more to that specific area. And then I'm just gonna take my Real Techniques brush and start pouncing it into the skin. Make sure you get your ears, especially if you have self tanner on like I do. I'm gonna make sure everything blends together. Okay, so I'm gonna go in with, I think it's a little too dark. I'm gonna go in with my Makeup Forever uh, foundation stick, Ultra HD foundation stick, and just a little two swipes. Just lighten that up a little. <laughs> We're gonna try a new product today. I'm going to be using my Bobbi Brown foundation stick in the shade Warm Almond. I bought this maybe like, I want to say a year ago, to use it as like a contour and I've never used it. So we're going to try this out today. So I'm going to place where I want Okay. So I'm going to take, let me see. Yeah, I'm gonna take my real technique sponge and start passing that into the skin. I 
Okay, so that's all blended out, and now I'm gonna go in with my color corrector under my eyes. It's the Bobbi Brown Eye Serum. I've used it in like literally every video. I'm just gonna put that under here. And then I'm gonna go in with my Naked Skin Concealer. It's the Urban Decay. It's in the color Light Neutral. Okay, so my camera overheated, so I had to pause, but while I was waiting for my camera to cool down, I just did my eyebrows and that's it. I didn't do anything else. So, next step is to now set everything. So I'm going to go in with my Too Faced Peach Perfect Setting Powder and set the under eyes. And then I'm gonna go in and set that contour. So I'm gonna be using my Anastasia, Anastasia, <laughs> Anastasia Contour Kit. It is in the shade Light to Medium. And I'm gonna take my Morphe R10 brush and just dip into this shade right here and set that contour and tap off the excess. Omega bronzer and I'm going to just go right over and then just to make that a little more glowy I'm gonna go in with my global glow skin finish by MAC Alright, and for blush, I'm going to be using Lovejoy by MAC. Just, just a little bit on there because I'm not really a blush gal. Alright, so I'm going to brighten up in my under eye and clean up this contour a little bit. this liquid illuminator. It's by Josie Moran. Moran? It is her Argan illuminator. And just kind of start dabbing that into my skin. Alright, and then we're just going to go right over top of that with the Laura Geller Gilded Honey Highlighter. Which is a really pretty gold, like a soft gold. Beautiful. Alright, so we're going to take that shade again and hit the brow bone with it and then concentrate it in the center and then blend out all right so that does it for the face 
So I'm going to do the eyes, and the eyes are super simple, guys. Like, I didn't want to do anything super hard. So we're just going to take this stuff by Pure Cosmetics. It's the eye polish, and it is in the color Silk. I'm just going to, so this is like a liquid, but I think it dries down um, as like a powder. go in with a crease color. I'm going to take this color right here out of the Carly Bible palette. And then I'm not going to do liquid eyeliner, but I am going to go in with dark brown out of her palette and just kind of smudge it on the top of my uh, upper lash line just to give it some definition. You can just see, just a little more definition from the side than the side. And then once we put the lashes on, it'll blend in a little bit better. Okay, so I just threw on some mascara and I put eyeshadow on my lower water, water line, lower lash line. So now we're gonna throw on some lashes. So I'm going to be using the Coco Lashes and the Style Queen B. Alright, here are the lashes. They're super pretty, but I think they're just too much for my face. I like them, I just wish you could see the shadow a little bit more through them. But, oh well, it's pretty, I like it. So, I'm just going to put a little bit more mascara on my bottom lashes, because lashes are way too long and I think I need to add a little bit more mascara to my lower lashes. Alright, so we're gonna go in with MAC Boldly Bear Lip Liner and just line our lips. Alright, and then we're gonna go in with Too Faced Melted Liquid Lipstick and Melted Sugar. Just put some right in the center. And then I'm gonna go on top of that with my Lorac Pro Matte Lip Color in the shade Nude. Alright, I think, and I think, I know. <laughs> I'm gonna go on top with my Saint Tropez Lip Topper by Jouet. Let's just add some sparkle. Alright guys, so that does it for this look. I hope you enjoyed this glowy, bronzy, dewy skin and eye makeup look. <laughs> Um, I actually do really love the lashes now, now that everything's kind of put together on the face. Um, I don't think they're too much anymore. I think they're just the perfect amount of wispiness and, I don't know, I just, I like the lashes now. As you can see, I'm super glowy all over. So I'll just get up close for you guys so you can see it a little bit better. Super glowy, the eyes are perfect, I think. The lip color looks great. 
I love that lip color. I don't think I've never used it. Um, I've used them all individually, but not all together, but I really like it. It's like the perfect pinky nude, even though I have tons of pinky nude lipsticks. Um, they're just off the front of my opinion. <laughs> Again, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to subscribe down below and give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. And let me know in the comments down below what kind of videos you want to see next. The next video I film will probably have a different background because my grandparents are going to be living with me for a month and they're taking over this room. So I won't have this room anymore. Um, but hopefully I can film in my room but it'll just be a different background. So hope you, hopefully you guys don't mind that. Um, yeah, again, I hope you guys enjoyed this as much as I did, and until next time, guys, I'll see you then.